A huge thank you to our channel member, Brandon Plainspotter. Wait until you see it. Wait until you see it. Wait until you see it. Okay, here we go. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you ever have a moment in your life uh, where you sort of immediately regret doing something? This is one of those moments. <laughs> I'll let you just let you soak it in. Soak it in for a moment. Just while I find the checklist, just uh, soak it in. <laughs> soak it in, folks. Not close enough. There we go. That's the one I want. Okay. Yes. Good evening. Welcome to <laughs> Welcome to your Friday flight night here on the Departure Lounge YouTube channel. And I hope that you, yes you, are well. I don't know. This all feels very weird. Honestly, this feels very, very, very strange. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it all feels very, very strange doing this. Um, we're on board tonight. <laughs> 
a fantasy livery and aircraft. Uh, we are on board a Ryanair 787-10. And we're at Kerry Airport for, for, to make it even better. We're at Kerry Airport uh, and we are going to be flying to Faro in Portugal tonight with a flight time of an hour and 53 minutes. Okay. So what do we think? <laughs> um, I'm noticing a little bit of buffering. Gonna have to keep an eye on that. My internet is is fine, it's, so it's not me. Uh, this will be YouTube doing this. This is not me. My internet is absolutely fine. Um, so I've re-downloaded GSX. However, it is not functional at this airport for some odd reason. So we're going to start the plane up, push back, and get out of here. Do things the old-fashioned way this evening. So let me know what you think. Uh, we have scenery for Kerry Airport too. Let's just have a quick nosy around. Very small airport is Kerry. Bit of scenery. This aircraft looks far too big for this. You get the idea. We've got clear skies, which is always nice as well. We've got a nice little sunset, which we'll see as well. But I mean... <laughs> That's the star of the show, folks, apparently. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. So it's already taken, what, eight minutes of the stream, however. It's off to bed for you. There you go. So yeah, so any lag that you will get through the stream is not me. My internet is fine. It is YouTube doing YouTube things tonight. So before we uh, kick things off, then we're not gonna, we can't board or anything else because, like I said, for some reason the uh, um, the GSX doesn't recognise the airport for some reason. It's very old, so we're just gonna go old fashioned. So. Uh, let's say hello to the wonderful people uh, that are in the chat. Before I do that, let me just very quickly. Oh, I need to download that, so I'm going to do that now. Okay. Uh, I'll also tell you something really funny that happened earlier. <laughs> so funny. So funny. Those in the group chat will know. Um, um, Lynn saying it seems to have settled. Hopefully it has. If not, blame YouTube. That is the only way. Okay, do you know what? We'll get a screenshot and then upload it. I can't be bothered right now. Uh, any chance you can get rid of the chat? Yes, of course, absolutely. If it helps, I can do that. Um, there you go. Easy enough. Hopefully that's better. Okay, so let's say hello to those that are in the chat then, shall we? So we have, of course, Jim. You, sir, are a legend. Absolutely. Welcome. Uh, Carl Crawford, hello. Lynn Keeble. Show me your wallet. Show me your wallet. Show me your wallet. Hello, hello. Uh, Nonstop Dom is here. Sarah, of, of course, Sarah's here. <laughs> Sarah's here, of course. Dogwood, hello. Just seen you pop into the chat there. Um, Linky will Sarah. Uh, Wayne is here too. Back streets, back, all right. Hello, hello. Um, Carl's, uh, yeah, Carl Crawford saying, "Evening, Tom. How dare you? But that livery on a seven eight seven. Don't ask. Uh, <laughs> don't ask. 
Um, Brandon Plain Spot is there as well, I know. Uh, so hello to you. When he comes back. Because I know he's here. But when he, when we come back. Okay. Let's uh, not waste any more time. Excuse me. Let's uh, get this aircraft started. Uh, so, it's been a while since I've done the 787, so batteries can go on. Oh, you bastard. I knew this was going to happen. Okay, we might not need the external power. We might be fine. I knew, I knew, I knew that was going to happen. Departure on one two seven decimal five squawk zero four four two. Ryanair tree Echo Romeo read back correct. You bastard. Um. Is that is that doing its thing? The answer to that question is no. It is not. Okay. Quick restart. We're back in a sec. <laughs> Couldn't find valid airport data at this position. Services are not available. Just want to get the. Uh, I just want to start the plane. Like. Couldn't find valid airport data at yes. this position. Shush. Services are not available. Just we know, we know. Thank you. Oh no! What are you doing? Okay. Just a quick test here, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, this is annoying. Ryanair Tree Echo Romeo cleared to Faro Airport as filed. Take off runway 26 climb and maintain 13,000 feet. So external power's on, yeah. Departure on 127.5, squawk 4343. Ryanair Tree Echo Romeo, read back correct. That's the engine starting, but we don't have screens. Why? Why do we not have screens? This is like the standard time to align is one minute. Okay. Okay. So, what I'm going to do very quickly, okay, I'm going to just bring up Volanta, I'm going to restart the sim. Uh, because I feel like it might be needed. So you can see on there, um, it won't take very long to reload anyway, so it's fine. Um, on the sim, you, oh sorry, on the screen I should say, uh, you can see the route that we're doing today. Uh, of course I did not forget, I was just waiting for you to come back. Here you go, enjoy. <laughs> Yeah, if you can see the tail number, that's not a real tail, obviously. That's something that I've put in there. I just put, yeah, Echo India. What the fuck? So while we're waiting for the sim to reload and do its thing, let's say hello to our resident super chat reader, uh, Emma Royd. So Emma, be interested to see how she feels about this this evening. Uh, how are you? And uh, hello. Good evening, everyone, and well done. You all made it to the weekend. Give yourselves a round of applause. Tom, I have two questions for you tonight. Okay. How funny was it tricking Max to turn off his 737 whilst on your lunch break? So funny. I'll get into that in a minute. I found it funny. I think many people would have found it funny. Also, second question. Who suggested this flight? I bet it was Sarah, wasn't it? 
She suggested Ryanair and the 787, only she could do that. What do you think about the livery and aircraft? I think it's, uh, I think it's very odd. Odd is not the word. Trust me, it's vile. And Sarah, you and I are best friends, but fuck sake girl, have a word with yourself. <laughs> sake? So, mm -hmm. Clearly Emma's English is still not up to date at the moment, so I'm going to have to teach her a few, uh, few words. Um, especially sake being sake, but um, yeah, there you go. So you've been told by Emma, Sarah. <laughs> it's just weird. This is going to fuck people's heads up, you know that, don't you? Yes, it's fucking my head up and it's probably fucking everyone else's too, so there you go. Um, just, yeah, let them know the standards, uh, the, uh, the, the requirements rather, please. Let's go for it. Two pounds, two dollars, or two euros or more will get me talking tonight, as it's Friday night, I'm feeling generous. So for every super chat sent in, I will personally send you a nude. <coughs> Sorry, I meant new picture of the departure lounge team. Of course, any donations are always appreciated by us all. So enjoy the stream, and happy Friday. Did she just say nude? <laughs> Fuck's sake, Emma. I know it's Friday, but Jesus wept. <coughs> God almighty. Jesus. There you go, if ever there was an incentive. Goodness me. So, two pound, two euros, or two dollars or more. <coughs> God, oh, that really caught me off guard. Jesus Christ. Thanks, Emma. Bloody hell. Uh, yeah, two dollars, two euros, or two pounds, or more, will get her reading out your super chats this, uh, this evening. Oh my God. Literally. <laughs> Literally. What a way to start Friday. <laughs> what a way to start Friday. God almighty. So glad I wasn't drinking there. Also, Sarah, you got owned by Emma. Uh, how do you feel, please? I'll get onto the, the, mm, I'll get onto what I did earlier with uh, on my lunch break. I thought it was so funny. Well, it was so funny. So, just while I'm setting the flight up, I was on my lunch break. Um, and uh, I happened to pop onto the street, onto the Instagram, and saw that Max was live. Uh, trying to, uh, trying to fly the 737 again. So, me being me. That's not, that's, that's the one we want. I don't know why he's giving us that. Uh, me being me. Um, I sat there and uh, thought, do you know what would be really funny? <laughs> do you know what would be really, really funny? Uh, is if I was to, um, you know, mess about a little bit. So I did. So I messed about a little bit. And uh, Max had pushed back in his seven, uh, 737. And I sat there and said, basically, when you've pushed back, if you turn the battery off, uh, it will help preserve the aircraft's power. Does anyone want to guess what he did? <laughs> By the way, it took him 90 minutes to uh, to to actually get to push back. Does anyone want to want to guess what Max did with my suggestion of turning the battery off? <laughs> I was dying, honestly. I, I, people coming into the to the office, like asking me if I was all right. I was like, I'm just, I'm laughing. I'm literally laughing my head off. And then Max raged to quit his stream because I told him to turn the battery off in his 737, and it did turn off. <laughs> oh dear. You're gonna have some fun. He did it and then flung his phone. Says Sarah. Yeah, <laughs> that's what happened. Oh dear. Alright, back into it. Let's go. Please work. I don't know why it wouldn't work, but please work. Well, she Kev, hello, good evening to you. Hope you're well. I will just make sure that the aircraft works before we take the Volanta thing off.
dear lord Couldn't work. find valid airport data at this position. Yeah. Services are yeah. not available. Shut up. Shut up. <gasps> what is wrong with the 787? Why is it not? Okay, do you know what? Let's let's just go with it. Because do we turn off the external power at some point? I'm sure we do. Ryanair Tree Echo Romeo cleared to Faro Airport as filed. Take off runway 26 climb and maintain 13,000 feet. Departure on 127 decimal flight. I'm so confused. Let's just go with it and we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, Concord South of Ireland, that is somebody flying um, Heathrow to Washington on that one. Right, let's just go with it. Because otherwise we'll be here for a while. We may not need the external power, it's not needed all the time. Oh, this, just, this, this aircraft just looks so weird. It looks so weird in a Ryanair livery. Um... Right. The other thing we need to do is I'm just going to get the traffic in as well. Uh, Kev says, no, I'm not well. Got to go into work for four hours tomorrow. Not a happy bunny. Ouch. Fingers crossed it will pass quickly. Okay, so we've got aircraft coming in to carry. Why? Can we not use the external? Oh, that's really bothering me. All right, let's just let's just let's let's do it. Let's just go for it. So the uh, ILS is on. Uh, sorry, IRS is on. Hopefully the APU starts. Um, if not, we'll have to slightly cheat, and then I'm gonna have to work out why it's not working. That is the APU starting. That is good news. That is very good news. Okay, <clears throat> so nav lights and logo lights can go on for now. Uh, and we want the emergency lights. Am I blind? No, nope. so we still can't use the external power. Very strange. Again, we might not need it. We're just we're gonna completely ruin it. Um, where the feck are the emergency lights? There, look. Right, they're armed already, so that's fine. We don't need to touch that. Armed and guarded. That is cool. Right, FMs. Yeah, and we've got power. Excellent, that's fine. Um, okay, position in it. Uh, our reference airport for today is uh, Echo India Kilo Yankee. So that's fine. Uh, that's now in there and sorted. Uh, that's in there. That's our flight number, so that's fine. Um, flight number today is Ryanair. Three Echo Romeo. Yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so we can sort that out. That's fine. Our cruise altitude today is thirty four thousand. Get in there, thank you. Execute that. Uh, cost index we know is 15, because I've just seen that on my sim brief thing. Why are you not clicking? Thank you. Um, reserves, we'll go for three. Fine. Uh, flaps. 
what can we set them to, well set them to 10 degrees because we're going to need all the lift we can get invalid entry at the moment do we have to like guess it we may have to do something else um, in fact we probably do actually we need to do the legs here uh, departure and arrival so uh, we're going off of runway 26 at Kerry today uh, we are going off of oh it's direct okay um, yeah so we're, we're direct out of uh, out of Kerry and then our approach to Faro is on the Arnav e Arnav 10 that's already there so that's fine Right, can we do it now? Why, you know, click! Yeah, there we go, cool. 143 is our V1 speed, uh, 148 is our rotate speed. Uh, and 156 is our point of no return, and our center of gravity is 19 degrees. So we're all done for that, so that's fine, that's sorted. We'll have a look at the legs and uh, to see if there's any discontinuities. There's one there, so we'll get rid of that. Execute, there's also another one. So we'll get rid of that. And that is good to go. Okay. So back to the overhead panel, we can set the uh, up the top here, flight deck door power, flick that to on. Uh, the window heaters are already on there, unless they are somewhere else, which I don't think they are. They look like they're already on, unless, because that's them there. Windshield ice. That was back up. In fact, we'll get those on, so that's fine. So it is those ones. I'm trying to, like, remember uh, Seatbelts to on, despite the fact that we can't board anybody today because GSX does not want to recognize. Couldn't find valid airport data at this position. Does, Services are not available. Shut up! Doesn't want to recognize uh, recognize the airport, um, so that's fine. So we're not going to board anybody today. We're just going to push back and go. Um, the anti ice can be switched. Just one flick to the right for auto. Um, external lights to on. I think we've done that. External lights. I felt that's somewhere, but we don't necessarily need it. Um, even GSX doesn't like Ryanair. No, GSX for some reason doesn't recognize Kerry, which is very strange. Um, uh, aircon left and right packs. Oh, for God's sake, what? There we go. So those to on. Uh, oh, uh, auto. Well, on. Yeah, the auto is fine. Um, and the recirc recirculation fans. Turn those on too. Um, okay. MCP two twenty for climb out today. Flight directors on. Uh, what was our climb? 13,000 feet, that's fine. Uh, select stabilizers by putting it into the green box. We need to do that. So that's that there. So we can do that by pressing button our joystick, get that into the green box, which is good. Um, back to the overheads. Uh, hydraulics C1, C2, uh, C1 to auto, C2 to auto, uh, left uh, left electric hydraulic pump to auto, and uh, the right one to auto as well. Uh, the fuel pumps can now go on. Ideal. Um, we'll get the beacon on because we're about to push back and start. Now we can push back, and the annoying thing is we have to now go back to using the fucking in-game in-game sim bloody pushback whatever you want to call it 
We may get some GSX stuff at uh, at Faro when we get there, just for like the the gates and stuff. But we don't have it here, which is annoying. So let's request pushback. I'm gonna go back into full screen here. What I am gonna do just very quickly is I'm just gonna get a screenshot because I need it for Volanta. God, it's a weird looking plane. I'm still unsure about how I feel about this. Uh, Darren Graham Photography, good evening to you. Happy Friday, hope you are well. Welcome to the stream. Um, let me just sort Volanta out here with that screenshot. God, it's weird. <laughs> it's such a weird, weird thing we're doing here. Uh, Kev says, uh, I'm off to Faro in April. Very good. Very nice. Okay, so we're, we're half pushing back. The annoying thing is we haven't got much room to push back. You see that? We do not have much room <laughs> to push back. Um, so I'm actually going to leave the parking brake on. Uh, because it will allow us to get some good guidance for where we actually need to be. Um, okay, so we can come down to the bottom here. We can set the transponder, so we don't need to worry about that when we take off. Um, there we go. So there's the transponder. We'll get that over to TARA. So the little indentation is now over TARA. So we don't need to worry about the uh, transponder now. Uh, so we'll start the engines by selecting number two the end number's going up as well so we'll get that going I'm actually going to stop the pushback Carry ground RYA and IR tree Echo Romeo requesting the end of pushback. Ryanair tree Echo Romeo request to end pushback received. Going to get the uh, parking brake back on. Uh, back up to the top, we'll just flick starter engine number one. Flick the fuel. Uh, Darren Graham says, uh, sorry, but it looks like a dildo with wings. Kev says, uh, that's Jack's favourite airplane, though. <laughs> Very good. Carry ground, our way in IR train, Echo Romeo, with Charlie ready to taxi IFR. Okie dokie. Um, that was a massive pushback. It wasn't massive at all. I'll tell you. Look, I'll tell you where we went. We we've we've barely moved. <laughs> we've we've barely moved. Uh, only because uh, the grass is literally there, and we have to try and maneuver this seven eight seven at a very small airport. Um. So yeah, so that, that's that's the reason why uh, we've only done it. That's why I left the parking brake on. Yeah, that's why I left the parking brake on. Um, okay, so uh, APU can now come off. Ideal, actually, that we don't need to use the external power because that makes things a lot a lot easier. Um, the lights can go on now as well. We've got 10 degrees of flaps to put on as well. Um, so we can look up here. We can go... Oh my Christ, are we moving? Oh my goodness me. Okay, so we are moving. So that parking brake needs to go back on, really. Oh God. <laughs> Is the parking brake on? Hmm. 
Yeah, I think he might go. I th Do you know what? Literally, look at this, though. I, I mean, in true Ryanair fashion, I mean, I'm not doing anything wrong. <laughs> it's what Ryanair would do, right? Um. Right, yeah, lights. Let's get lights on. Um, so, run we turn light, taxi light on as well. Uh, we'll get the flap set to 10 degrees. Can we do 10 degrees? We can do 10 degrees, which is ideal. So, we will do that. Uh, that's why 787 is way too heavy to come to any small airports like this. You do not have any idea. Um, please don't, uh, don't say anything. Alright, parking brake can now come off. Let's get this aircraft round. <laughs> It's going to be quite tight, this one, but let's go. Okay, we, 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 we may, we may, we may have to manually push back here. We are going to have to. Okay, here we go. Reverse is on. Here we go. This is totally against protocol. Ideal. Nothing happened. We're all good. We're all set. Okay. We can't seem to... We can now. I mean, the, the truck's having a bit of a field day at the moment. Right, let's go. Uh, Sarah says you're going to miss all the scenery. It is what it is. <laughs> It is what it is. So, we need to get this aircraft round. Which we've sort of... I mean, we might miss the catering truck. In fact, we are going to miss the catering truck. Is that 08 there? Boy, oh boy, is takeoff going to be fucking interesting. Look how short that runway is. That is a lot shorter than I imagined. Okay, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Okay. So we may have to backtrack here as well. Backtracking is fine. Uh, we can now set the flaps to 10 degrees. There you go. 10 degrees. We're going to have to really power these engines up, you know. Uh, Kev says that's what she said. Oh, of course. Very good. Alright. Let's get the strobes. Landing lights on. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Let's. Uh, this is going to be. Very interesting to say the least. Let's go. Bit of power. It just looks weird. It really, really does look weird. However, Sarah did request that we do the 787 in the Ryanair colours from Kerry. hoping we can actually get to our speed perfectly. Not taking off just yet, it's not the best part of the stream just yet. We're backtracking all the way down to the bottom end. Uh, Kev says this is going to be fun, this is going to be arse clenching, I think. This is going to be edge of your seats. I have no idea if this is going to be successful or not. 
I've got no idea. Place your bets. Absolutely. Now's a really good time. Now is a perfect, perfect time um, to place your bets. Uh, to whether you think this could be, you know, whether we can get it out of the airport or not, basically. I think we can. I think we can. I've got faith. I think we can. <clears throat> this is where the uh, the airport doesn't have a turning turning place. I'd like to think it's got a turning spot. Fucking doesn't. What airport doesn't have an in-turning spot? Alright, we're going to use the grass. It's not ideal, but we are going to use the grass. To turn this airport airplane round. Uh, full throttle with brakes on until the very last minute. We are going to warm the uh, warm the tyres up for sure. And the, and the engines. Man, this plane is... You can see why this plane is not built for this airport. Holy crap. Okay. If we can just get this round. I mean we're not we're not quite on the grass yet. Scratch that, we are on the grass. <laughs> oh, okay, the worst thing is that I can see the red lights already from the other end of the runway. So Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just point it here. And then as we get rolling, I am going to correct it. So. Now comes the best part. Okay? Now comes the best part. Here I go. Off. Well, off I go. Sound goes up. I go off. And enjoy. Easy. <laughs> Easy peasy. The um the ten degrees of flaps I think helped enormously. What are we missing then? What are we missing here? Okay, 
interesting. Okay, I say easy peasy. See, I've, I've not had time to think about this or even look at it. Hell no, it's there. Okay, now we're following the line. Interesting. Interesting, it didn't want to follow the flight plan. But it is now. I, I feel like I'm literally so out of touch with the flight sim because I haven't done it for like four days. And I've had to reinstall everything. So we're now past 10,000 feet, so landing lights can come off. Let's get some screenshots. Just it it looks it looks so bizarre. Yeah, don't ask about that. That's basically got the... So this reg here, that ASX is like the standard print of a default uh, default reg on the plane. And they've uh, plastered this reg over it. It's not a real one. So I'm, I'm sort of ignoring it. But, uh, yeah... There is our beautiful, <laughs> our very interesting Ryanair 787 on its way to Faro this evening. Now, I believe... Would, but I'd like to have been given that. That'd be nice, thanks. So there you go. That's our Ryanair 787. It's still so weird. 
so so strange to do this but uh, yes here we go clickety click as everything goes on Just, just very odd. It's, uh, because I haven't flown the 787 for a while, I'm honestly feeling like I'm trying to get used to like the planes again. It's all, it's all very odd, very strange. But, uh, but yeah, so I've got more planes to download and stuff like that yet. So uh, fear not. There you go. At least we got it working now, so we're good. Uh, Jim Gilmore says that it's, uh, it's a proper reg. It, do you know what? It probably is. Because so, so most of the repaints, especially for like the Neos, uh, the set, like seven three, uh, sorry, A three twenty Neos and stuff like that, are s some of the repaints are based around like the A three twenty or things like that. Um, so yeah, th sometimes it's. Yeah, sometimes they're based off of like real regs and stuff, and it probably is a real reg, as Jim's just mentioned. But um, you, you 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 get what you you know, you you can only do so much with what you're given. I mean, it's not every day we're going to be flying a Ryanair seven eight seven. The music goes on and our Friday night begins. I bet we all know someone else who will though. You'll have to forgive me because like I've had a bit of a weird day. I know who you're on about, of course. Excuse me. Yeah, I can't think what you're on about though. Uh, Max, it's Tom once again. Sir, thanks very much for the streams you've been doing for us. Sure, no worries. Uh, I've also got to choose what we're flying tomorrow. As well. Ryan Dull. No, it's not dull at all. I'm just I've had a bit of a busy day today. Still can't get used to it. Can't get used to it. Alright, 
So in the background, I'm going to be downloading some uh, some more planes as we as we do this. Uh, and also, <clears throat> I've uh, re-downloaded the uh, landing rate uh, monitor that we have. Uh, as well, so that will also be making uh, a reappearance uh, once we get a little bit closer to uh, Faro in Portugal. So yeah, so I've got to decide as well what we're going to be doing tomorrow, what we're going to be flying, etc. Going to be quite limited because I've got to re-download planes. <laughs> it's a little bit annoying, but uh, yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Going to one two three decimal nine or five far way in our tree Echo Romeo. Shanwick Center, our way in our tree Echo Romeo is passing flight level two two five, climbing flight level three three zero. Because the worst thing is, is I've gone for like uh, the Neo and probably probably the seven eight seven as well. Actually, I need to re-download the sound packs, uh, yeah, sound packs as well. So yeah, there's there's a there's a lot for me to do to get the sim back to where it was. A lot for me to do. Right, let's see what I can do tomorrow. <laughs> Still got to re-download all of the uh, 737 jet as well. Uh, send you a livery in the theme of the stream tonight, says Dom. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Very nice. I know what Thomas just seen, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, just seen it. That's uh, that's weird. <laughs> it's probably the best way of putting it. It's weird. Okay, so at the moment I've got the uh, KC-135s downloading again and I've also got the ATRs downloading as we speak. There are other aircraft that I will be downloading. Um, there's one in particular that I am looking at right now, um, but there's no livery packs for it at the moment to download either. Uh, so, I don't really want to download that at the moment. 
Yeah, so um yeah, so there's a there's a a particular plane, but there's no liveries for it at the minute, and there's another one as well that's coming with one livery. And again, there's no livery packs for it yet. Uh so yeah, so I might I might download them tomorrow. And just see what happens. I'm just trying to get the aircraft back. I've got the BAE 146 back. Uh, I've also got uh, the Fokker 28, which I've tried. And honestly, I cannot, for the life of me, I cannot get my head around it. I can't get my head around the autopilot. It's so strange. So I may have to just completely forget about the Fokker 28, which is slightly annoying because it now works. <laughs> But it's like I can't, I can't do the autopilot. I've looked at so many videos, and it's just it, it fries my brain. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to. I'm going to put some roots into the chat on a poll uh, and um, let you lot decide what we can do. I think it's probably going to be the best option. What is that? What, what airport is that? What airport's that? Oh, maybe not. So yeah, so I'll, uh, I'll get to the, the chat very shortly. Uh, what about the tri-motor flight? Uh, I don't have the tri-motor. I don't have any interest in downloading it. Uh, so, let me know, please, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let me know. Very important question right now. What do you have for your tea? What do you have? What do you have for your tea? I add uh, a takeaway, and I add uh, a cheeseburger with mac and cheese in it. Mac and cheeseburger, basically. And it was bloody lovely. It was, it was wonderful. Uh, Dom says, pork and haggis sausages. Excuse me. With salad. Very nice. Poshy Kev, garlic and herb potatoes, tomatoes and fish. That sounds lovely. Uh, Loopy says, fry up and evening all. Evening Loopy, hope you are well. Welcome on board the very strange flight that we're doing tonight. Welcome <laughs> uh, with the Ryanair 78. I don't think you had to see it. No. No, we're not going to see it. It's annoying. But our uh, Ryanair 787-10. <laughs> it's so strange. So strange to even say that. Um, yes. Yeah. Uh, Wayne says uh, Jackie spuds with sausage and, sausage and bacon filling and cheese topping. That sounds lovely. 
That's very nice. Uh, limb keeble with a ham and egg salad. Very nice. Beautiful. Uh, I saw it in the Lurkers Lounge. Very odd, says Loopy. Bizarre, innit? <laughs> Don't do these fantasy flights often. If at all. This is proving to be one of those times where we're doing it. <laughs> yeah. uh, let me know about music levels as well. Does the music need to go down a little bit more? Or are we good? Uh, Loopy says, why not an easy jet triple seven? Oh, don't get that. <laughs> Can you imagine? Could you imagine? Th there is an easy jet triple seven available. There is. There's a there's a livery for it. Problem is because I've had to do a hard reset on the triple uh, on the uh, flights, I'm gonna ha I have to re-download the triple seven and the sound pack and everything else. So, I mean, yeah, there's, there's a lot of annoyance that I'm having to go through at the moment in terms of getting everything back for the flight scene. But, yeah, going through it slowly. Slowly but surely. Um, right, the KC-135, or at least one of them, has downloaded. So I'm going to put that into the game now. Uh, odds on Max has a triple set? Well, probably, most likely. Wouldn't surprise me, Jim, it really wouldn't. Wouldn't surprise me now if he goes and does a flight with it. Okay, KC 135 in, done, dusted, good stuff. Next aeroplane. Uh, in fact, let's. Can we download that? How long would it take? Really? Download that tomorrow. <laughs> Download that tomorrow. Uh, what about you? How long would you take? You shouldn't take too long. What? Really? Okay. Download you tomorrow. Uh, we got that one. That's fine. What? Yeah. So what it does do is it allows me when I've got these airplanes downloaded to download liveries only like real life ones. And then, like, when we do these fantasy things, to, like, download a few of them. So, rather than get, like, a mega pack for the 320 Neo, I've just downloaded, like, a handful of liveries. And, my God, it's so much easier. So much easier than downloading, like, a, a mega pack. Uh, right. We may have to go down this route. What's this, then? How big is this? Okay. How long would you take? So now we're going to start re-downloading these 737s. Get them back. It's fine. We'll leave it running. It's fine. We'll leave it at that for the moment. Don't want to muck about too much with it. Uh, what's tomorrow's time? Uh, well, I've got to... Uh, in fact, I'm still looking through and having to flick through uh, flight radar. Um, because I want your opinions on flights that we can do. So, uh, let me have a look. Is that a flight from there? I'd be surprised if there isn't. Ooh, um, may, mm, hmm, okay. <clears throat> That's a shame. That's not the uh, not the one I'm thinking of.
I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Really? Really? Oh, that is surprising. Okay, right. So we're going to have to look for... Okay, I thought there would be. Obviously not. Yeah, so tomorrow's flight time will depend on the route. That's a pretty cool one. Let's see if we can do that. Um, okay. And what do we want it from? I think I know who flies that one. Tell you what, yeah, let's go for it. Let's do that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sorry, I'm not, uh, not ignoring you, I promise. I'm literally just trying to get this poll together. Um, Paul Hussey, hello, good evening to you. Uh, are you rescheduling the Ljubljana flight for this weekend? I can certainly do that. Uh, we can do that on Sunday? Sunday during the day before the quiz? Uh, quiz, it's not quiz today, it's not quiz this weekend. Uh, before rank my liveries. doesn't happen at the weekend uh, it will definitely happen during the week uh, the Heathrow to Ljubljana flight uh, I need to book a game of uh, a game of FIFA in with you. Um, yeah, I need to re-download first. <laughs> I've got to re-download a whole load of things. So, uh, so yeah, uh, I will um, take you up on that for sure. Do you know what the problem is at the moment? There's a lot of like flights here that I'm looking at going, oh, that would be quite nice. Um, and then... It turns out that most of it will be under the cover of darkness because obviously winter is on its way. And a lot of the nights now are getting like dark quite early. Like normally now you'd see like the sun setting, whereas like on the sim it is completely dark ish. So it's um yeah, it's a little bit like almost you. Uh, when we're doing the thing with the thingies. Ooh, good point. Uh, 
them? When should we do them? When should we do them? When should we do them? Okay, let's mention it. Uh, Paul Hussey gifting uh, one Departure Lounge membership. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, very, very kind. Um, like I say, Emma is available for reading out your super chats. So uh, two pounds, two euros or two dollars or more and she'll read out your super chats live on the stream. Uh, yes, uh, I'll have a think. It'll, it'll either be... We'll mention it Sunday, I think. And then we may do it, like, during the week. Because I think the week is when we're going to be, like, streaming, like, every day. And then we'll do, like, two a night or something. Because it's, like, what? Well, there should be enough to do about two a night, I think. So we'll, we'll do it that way, I think. Sarah's a lover of winter too. Good stuff. Glad it's not just me. Uh, Max says, uh, who's doing Rate My Liveries? That'll be Rob Brown on the Rate My Liveries uh, show this weekend. Not you, that's for sure. <laughs> well I've said there, Jim. Is that a thing? It is a thing. Okay. Let's get a 
another flight on the plan then. Uh, how do they rate my liveries if need someone says Dom? Uh, that's uh, that, yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, I think we've got Rob Brown doing it this month, but you can always free. Hey, you're welcome to do the following month if you like. Sure as hell won't be Max doing it. As much as we'd love to have him on the show. Uh, how long have we got left on the flight, by the way? Okay, so one, uh, one hour left on the flight, apparently. Goodness me. It's not long at all. Uh, what date is next month? Oh, God, you're going to make me work it out. Uh, uh, Bring my Quiz. Well, um, Hey, everything's gone all fucking skewiffy now. Something dear. What was the last quiz we did? Two weeks ago. What day was that? 3rd September, that was a quiz. Modern Mania dropping. Rain my liveries, quiz. Model media, drop in. Rate my liveries. 22nd. Uh, 22nd of October. Twenty second of October is the uh, next break my liveries. Just getting the last route uh, set up for the pole. Okay, no one, no one block it. No one block it. says, Tom, I've got a podcast YouTube channel. It's called The Match Jet Podcast. Okay. No one block it. No one mute him. No one time him out. No, no one do anything. I would like to see a link, please, in the chat. I think that's the only way. If a link cannot be provided. Jim, please uh, put him on timer. But only if a link cannot be provided. And I'll give you the uh, I'll give you the the nod to say yeah. Here you go. That'll be enough. So let's, uh, yep. Uh, only mods and hosts can post links. So what I mean is he can link it to me through Instagram or Facebook. So, yeah. He's got. 
oh, how long have we got left on the flight? I'll give them some time to really sort of come up with one. We've got an hour and two minutes left. We're due to land at half past nine. I'm going to give him till nine o'clock to give me uh, a link via Instagram. If he cannot provide one, Jim, I'd like you to time him out, if you know what I mean, for the rest of the stream. That's what I've, that's my that's what I've come to for that sort of thing. Can't sit and say you've got something if you can't prove it. Delete, 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 delete. Ah, yes. <laughs> I will delete you. Not yet. I'm going to give him the generous time of until 9 o'clock. And then it'll be DELETION! <laughs> uh, meanwhile... For those of us who are still enjoying the stream here, I will delete you. Uh, that will be the longest 30 minutes on a record, probably, most likely. Most likely. Luby says Tom will land first. In fact, we could do some homework here, but I'm also feeling like you shouldn't be looking for it. So I'm going to say no to don't look for it. Let's just wait and see what happens. Half an hour, he's got. Trying to find uh, a, a varied route here. Just not quick enough, says Loopy. <laughs> Don't clock watch, it's the worst thing you can do. Yeah, definitely don't clock watch. Okay, if you have another view, you so have. <laughs> I like it. That's amazing. Uh, also, can we just give a shout out, please, to the fact that it's it's autumnal weather and wearing hoodies is now acceptable. I am so happy, so happy that I get to wear hoodies and feel super comfortable wearing hoodies now as well because it's, it is cold. I am loving life right now. Loving the cold weather, the fact I get to wear hoodies. Totally in my element right now. Ooh, I like that. That is a great shout. That is a fabulous shout for an airport. Let's have a look. Is that the one? That is the one. Oh my, yes, that's uh Ooh, we can have a bit of a Ooh. 
We've got a challenge on our hands here. Oh, it's not long enough though. Ugh. Wait, is that from the same as... It is. That's 39 minutes. Oh, that's... That's annoying. That's 28. Oh, shit. No. Oh, f uh, How long is that runway? That little runway is not long enough. But I like that. Uh, I've got nothing to go there though, which is annoying. Uh, hang on a sec. Let's have a look. Now hold on. No way. Really? No. Jim, no. Uh, Sarah says, are you still picking bloody roots? I'm trying to do a little bit of a varied uh, a varied thing. Um, hello, Steve. Uh, Verwood Kitman Steve is here. Uh, it says, can't lie, I'm half pissed. Happy Friday, all. <laughs> Very good. Welcome along, Steve. Hope you're well. Um, really? I'll be damned. Okay, so... I'll be damned. I think he's renamed that. I don't think that's a genuine channel because it's flight sim videos. It's not. It's not. Um, it's not a podcast, is it? I think he's just he's just renamed the channel. Right. Let me pick some more routes. Hang on. <laughs> I've got one more to pick. Deal. There we go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go with. Let's go with that. What time is it there at the moment? Okay. Okay. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Let's go, let's find... Nope, forgive me, that's B, not a Y, that's a B.
Mm-hmm. Oh, it's not long enough though. It's not it's not long. It's not long enough, which is annoying. Let's go, let's go with that. Let's go and have a look and see where we can go from here. <coughs> I want somewhere that's like... Uh, right, okay, so... Um... I think it's a rename. I think it's a rename. Don't think it's anything else, really. It's been running since like January this year. I think it's a rename. That's annoying. Um, non stop Dom it says, As you all have peeps, have peeps. Uh, can I ask, would anyone be interested in airline slash travel tips and videos? Yeah, go for it. Go for it. Stretch your wings, as they say. So they do now. Probably do that in a in a. What if we do that in a? What's the? I am talking to myself now. Just sorry. Could we do it? In that? I think we probably could. Uh, so. Why does it take? Okay. I'm uh, researching here. Two seconds. I've got the other route. Here we go. Ah, oh, here we go. Finally. In the chat. There you go. There is the poll for the flights for tomorrow. <clears throat> what would you like to see? Try to be uh, expansive and try to kind of mix it up a little bit. So I'll keep that poll running. <laughs> oh, Sarah, honestly.
That is quite funny, actually. I'm not going to lie. Uh, Carl says, Loopy's lost it. Yeah, Loopy has just lost his membership. That's weird. Shit happens, mate. <laughs> Okay, so we're just coming up to the uh, uh, north coast of Spain. We should be landing in uh, Faro in about 45 minutes. So, uh, Carl Crawford coming up with the gifted membership. Uh, thank you so much, dude. Um, that's going to um, Jim Gemmel. Jim getting the membership there. So, welcome aboard. I, I'd show you the outside, but quite frankly, it's that dark. You, you, you can't see anything. <laughs> The tail logo light is on, but it's not very bright, which is weird. So you can't see anything. Right? Uh, so don't forget, of course, the the flight, uh, the flight uh, that is being picked for tomorrow uh, will be done in the evening. Lynn Keeble coming up with the uh, one gifted departure lounge membership uh, for the Copyright Elite Club, uh, and that went to Schlaxim. So, welcome back on board, Schlaxim. Thank you very much, Lynn, for the kindness. Many people with their generosity today. Uh, Dogwood coming up with the one gifted uh, Copyright Elite Club uh, Parch Lunch membership. Going to James Cridland. Welcome back on board, Dogwood. Uh, well, uh, thank you very much for your generosity. Much appreciated. Is everyone trying to get this for Loopy? <laughs> I think they are. I think everyone's trying to give Loopy a uh, a membership. It's a shame you can't actually like choose who to give it to. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, David Bone says, "Good evening, everyone. Hope you're all behaving. We are indeed. Well, trying to." Most of us are behaving. Actually, that reminds me. Uh, now that you're here, that's an idea. Uh, David, can you please drop me a message? Please. Uh, I don't, it doesn't matter how. Just, uh, just could you please send me a message? That would be uh, that would be a delightful. Uh, 
Uh, Carl Crawford coming up with the one gifted departure lounge membership this time as well. Uh, going to Gemma Rowe. So welcome back on board. And Carl, thank you super. Uh, thank you super. Thank you so much rather for your uh, generosity there. I know what's happening here. People are trying to give it. To <laughs> People are like trying. Someone. Someone might get it. <laughs> yeah, it may. Uh, Kev says it may not select Loopy as his membership has just lapsed, and uh, Jim says, uh, "Fuck's sake, YouTube, give it to Loopy." Sarah coming up with a one gifted membership as well, um, <laughs> and that's gone to Kian Armstrong. So welcome back on board, and Sarah, thank you so much for your generosity, uh, as always. Thanks for trying, Lynn and everyone. It's just not meant to be, says Loopy. Someone will do it, and I think people will continue to try until it <laughs> until it happens. It's just uh, one person I'm hoping it doesn't actually go to. And it's not Max. I just I don't want the name popping up. But we'll see. Uh, Brandon's back. He says hello all again. Uh, had to pop out earlier. No worries, Brandon. Welcome back. You've missed a little bit of madness. Uh, so yeah, so if you, uh, if you don't know already, there is a poll in the chat uh, to suggest tomorrow's tomorrow night's flight. You have four choices. You've got Helsinki to Paris, Austin, Texas to Las Vegas, uh, Hamburg to Mallorca, or Brisbane to Adelaide. The roof will come off the TDL roof if Luffy gets it. Oh, everyone will go mental. Everyone will go nuts. You're all like, woohoo! <laughs> it's about bloody time. Uh, don't want that name in the chat like catching a case of the crowd. There's a name in particular that I know uh, from the past times of like gifting memberships has popped up I really don't want to see that name pop up um, Lee class good evening everyone he says so uh, welcome uh, Lee great to see you hope you're well uh, wouldn't be a long-haired lout uh, oddly enough no it's not <laughs> Yeah, no, oddly enough, no, it's not. It's not uh, It's not that loud. Brandon says, boss, I was away. Did Max donate that 50 quid? Did he bollocks? Um, is the name Min... Min Propeller Radio? Min Propeller... Eh? Is the name Min Propeller Radio? What you on about? <laughs> what are you on about? What am I not getting there? Um, opposite. Uh, oh, I yeah, I get it. I got it. Very good. No. No, because he's already got a membership, so it's not it's not him. <laughs> I'm glad you explained it, because literally I would not have got it. Sarah says, I know who it is. If you think you know who it is, please message me. Because I, I guarantee you don't know who it is. That's funny. <laughs> that is funny.
Uh, six minutes. But, uh, well, technically, Jim. We've already had the link. <laughs> well, not a link, but we, we know it exists. Because you sent me a picture. <laughs> you sent me the picture. <coughs> Okay, so the uh, the ATR is now back on the sim. We've got that downloaded. Uh, but no, Jim, do keep an eye. Keep an eye. You know what you're doing. Same rule still applies on the on the third strike. So at the moment on the poll, 17 votes. Um, Helsinki to Paris is leading the way. Then it's Brisbane to Adelaide, and then a tie between Austin to Las Vegas and Hamburg to Mallorca. Jim says he's behaving as he knows he's only got one strike left. May very well be the case. May very well be the case. Any Greek Iron flights coming up, Tom? There will be. Um, I think they are probably best done during the day. I think. Um, so, we'll, I mean, I, I definitely want to do Ski Ethos again. Definitely want to do that. Um, I feel like we're better suited now than we were before. So I, I'd definitely like to do Ski Ethos or Ski Ethos, depending on how you pronounce it, of course. Um, but yes, uh, excuse me, definitely some, um, definitely some more uh, Greek island flights coming up. Um. <laughs> the, uh, to me, they're better suited during the day because you get to see a little bit more. I'm just going to mute my mic two seconds, hang on.
Just keeping an eye on there. Uh, yeah, just just keeping an eye. And some other streams there. No, 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 <laughs> no, no. It was not. Okay, it was not for that. Max was running out his list of routes and I went to make sure he wasn't stealing any of what has, what has been put in the poll. And the reason I did that is because I was just leaning because of that. I'm... Fuck off. <laughs> Go away. Unbelievable, literally. Literally. Can't do anything and you lot just scrutinize. Always having a fart. I don't need to mute my mic for that. Definitely not. Sharing is caring and all that. All that good stuff. You had a straining face. No, I was just no. That's my concentration face. There was nothing, nothing of the sort. Uh, Dom, I have to. Uh, I have to because I have to make sure that uh, I'm not getting anything stolen. Yeah, thanks, Jim. I was hoping to sleep tonight, but now I'm not going to. Thanks. Appreciate that. The last fucking thing I need to think about is that. Flipping heck. My gold. You're welcome. Then you're welcome. Then <laughs> hmm. what a great name to call it, by the way. <laughs> I'm screen grabbing that face. You do what you like with it. <laughs> what you do with my face is entirely up to you. <laughs> Just, I'm laughing at whatever. <laughs> oh. The fact that Kev... <laughs> oh, Kev. Wing wang. <laughs> oh, dear. That is funny. Wang. <laughs> oh dear. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for Wing Wang. I feel like this needs to be a round in the quiz. Wing Wang. What's wing wang? <laughs> oh dear. 
Uh, Brandon says, have you got an app called Volanta? It's uh, to track the flight and sim and gives the landing freight is free too. Uh, I do indeed, Brandon. Uh, I've been using it for a while. Um, so yeah. No, I, I use Volanta to, uh, it, it gives me purpose uh, to fly on the flight sim. Lynn's laughing at Wing Wang! <laughs> Loopy says Wing Wang. Bleh. Yeah, I've already. Okay. <laughs> wing Wang. Wing Wang. Wing. Oh dear. Wing wang round or round wing wang? <laughs> oh dear. Wing wang round or round wing little wang? <laughs> oh dear. Wing wang round or round wing wang? There you go. Got there in the end. Third time lucky. Try saying that after a few westerns. I've got some westerns on order. I'll have them tomorrow and go wing wang and then wing wang round and round wing wang. <clears throat> uh, Wayne says, I swear this channel gets nuttier by the hour. That's why people love it, right? Wing wang. <laughs> I feel like there also need, might need to be a sound effect if we can just go wing wang. Like, let's just pop out of nowhere. I mean, Maybe not pop out of nowhere, that's what we don't want a wing thing to do. Uh, yeah. Um, Max says, oh god, I'm not reading that. <laughs> no, I'm not reading it. Not reading that. I'm not. I'm not reading it. <laughs> I'm not reading it. I'm not reading it. I'll get demonetized. Absolutely not. <laughs> Everyone in the chat can read it. And I'd like to hear your, or see your reactions to what Max has just put there. <clears throat> yeah, can we, can we, can we just... Oh, God. Make him stop. Money! Oh god. Wing wang the milkman tears of joy, tears of joy, tears of joy, heart suit, heart suit, heart suit, full score, full score, full score. <laughs> oh wow. Oh Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. The way she read that out then, I'm sure she was trying not to laugh. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> full score, full score, full score. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's funny. Oh, that's that's funny. <laughs> oh, that is that is quite funny. Oh. David Bone says, uh, <coughs> uh, how about on games night trying out Wing Wang Kaplunk? Uh, actually, no, that might not be so smart. Yeah, not, uh, not, the, uh, not the best move there for that. Uh, Jim says, uh, <laughs> thank, thank fuck it was wing wang and not, yeah, got it. <laughs> uh, Wayne says, can we not set up a GoFundMe page for Max to wing wang off to the south pole one way please? Wing wang. I feel like you have to say it with like proper enthusiasm. You gotta go wing wang. 
Like the bloke from, you know, like the bloke that did like the voiceover for the X Factor. Wing, wang. Wing wang. That's funny, dude. Wing won't. <laughs> Wing wang. I, I feel like we need a sound effect for this. What is Wing eBay? Yeah, FIFA night instead of e-scored. Oh, what a wing wang! <laughs> He's buried that right in the wing wang. Non-stop Don going for ooh ee ooh ah ah. You missed out the ting tang. What a what a wing wang. Ooh ee ooh ah ah ting tang walla walla wing wang <laughs> Oh there's so much you could do with it. Kev, that's brilliant. Kev's officially uh ruined the channel by uh, coming up with the old wing wang. The ball <laughs> Yeah. Oh that looks tough there, Clive. Uh, looks like the ball whipped him straight in the wing wang. <laughs> Oh dear. Air Portugal, six seven one descent and maintains fourteen thousand feet. My job done my job here is done, says Kev. Does Jack go wing wang after the grannies? <laughs> Time to head over to Jeff Shreves on the touchline. Jeff, uh, thanks, uh, Martin. Uh, basically, what happened was the ball hit him straight in the wing wang, and uh, he will be available to come back on as soon as possible. Thanks, Jeff. <laughs> oh, I've seen it. I'm just waiting for it. I've seen it. I'm just. <laughs> I've just seen it. Come on. Now I'm going to pause the music for it. <laughs> Come on. Here we go. Winky winky, winky wanky woo. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Emma is on form tonight. <laughs> oh. oh, that's so funny. Oh dear. She was much happier there. <laughs> That's because the word wanky was mentioned. Wanky wing wang. Doesn't work the other way around if you go wing wang wanky. You just go wanky wing wang. <laughs> Kev says definitely going for a smoke. Too many wings and wangs here. Like being in a gay club again. <laughs> I don't believe we've had any. Nope. Okay, not far out. 
Um, Wayne says, what if Sarah, the player on FIFA, though, are we now declaring Sarah got a wingman? Hmm. Oh, God. It's all just happening now. <laughs> it's all happening. Um, Jim says, wing wang bells, wing wang bells, wanging all the way. <laughs> Oh, what have we started here? Uh, aren't people who join the stream at this point expecting a flight sim to be slightly confused? Yes, they will be massively confused. 100%. If, if flying a Ryanair 787 was confusing enough, they've come into a chat that's full of wing wang. Um, Loopy says, I'm going for a Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> All that wing and wang does make you uh, hungry for chicken balls and rice. Uh, Brandon says, "Can we see the outside of the uh, of delivery?" You can, except you won't because it's dark. See? Uh, so I would suggest hanging fire for the replay. Because I'll knock the, the time back and uh, we'll um, have a. Uh, uh, we'll have the uh, the time knocked back and uh, we'll be able to see the uh, the aircraft in its uh, fullest. Dom says, "Is that the, the golden wing wang?" This has to be the, the channel's Christmas song, Jim. Yeah. Everyone has to get involved and do like a you know. A line of uh, wing wang bells. Wonky donkey. Uh, David says, "Is someone who stands uh, on top of an airborne aircraft known as a wing wang curve?" <laughs> oh dear. What has happened to the chat? But Loopy, thank you very much for your super chat there. Of, uh, yeah. Winky, 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 wanky, woo. <laughs> What's that? Jim, what did you send me? <laughs> Jim. <laughs> money. Oh, money, God. Money, money, money. oh, God. Oh, God. Wanker, 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 King Kong of wanker. Tears of joy, <laughs> tears of joy. Ah, oh, you lot are getting carried away now with this whole wing wang stuff. Oh, dearie me. Carl, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, dear. We'll have to wait and see what happens with YouTube. However, you know, it's not exactly the words, but we'll, we'll go for it. It worked. It did. If you if you like break it up, it will work properly. Yeah, it will work. Yeah. So, uh, how did you uh, get your uh, super chats there? Uh, basically, um, lots of wings and lots of wangs, and uh, I got the money for it. Oh, what fun it is to wang in a one-wing open sleigh, says David. You lot are totally on it. And you know this is going to carry on tomorrow as well. 
you just you know it will. Lots of wings, lots of wangs. It's all gonna happen. And I for one am all for it. Brandon says, no Jack tonight. Was there a cooking incident? I don't actually know where Jack is tonight. <laughs> oh, shut up, Kev. That's not what I... No. No. I said I'm all for it as in like the the entertainment purpose not 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 into wing wangs <laughs> what the fuck have I just said <laughs> Sarah says probably playing four go uh, four guys I don't actually know Jack's normally very active on the uh, Fake uh, book, book face. <laughs> Was that your way of no? No. Uh, sorry, Kev. No. I know that's kind of let you down a little bit. Okay, 84. 84 miles out. We haven't descended yet. I imagine we... Oh, actually, no, tell like we Because, yeah, all right. No, we should be fine. Because we're going to loop around. So we'll be fine. We'll be fine. So, at the moment, uh, Helsinki to Paris is winning. Uh, 33% and then there is a tie between Austin to Las Vegas and Hamburg to Mallorca 24% and 19% for Brisbane to Adelaide it's still very close with the poll if you haven't voted for what you want to see flight wise tomorrow um, then uh, make sure you do so by clicking uh, or voting for one of the four options in the chat have uh, a week's worth of uh, interesting I'll look at that in a minute uh, hello hello uh, Danish dropping a subscribe there so hi Danish or Danish it could be either or Uh, Carl says, Kev, Tom is your wing wang wingman. Very funny, very good. Alright, there we go. There's our call for descent. So, 220. So, uh, let's take the speed down to 2. 70. Let's get the speed brake up just to help us with the speed reduction. Uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, so uh, we need to get the KC, both KC 135s on to the flight sim. So we've got the KC 135 and the RC 135 going on there now. Uh, we've got the A330 Neo back as well, so we've got some flights that we can do with that. <coughs> uh, 
Um, right, yeah, so 737800 can go straight back on. Um, just sent you a video. Oh, God. Lord have mercy. Let's have a look. Oh, fuck's sake, what's this? I have no idea. No, 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 no. Nothing like that. Alright, so we can welcome back to the flight sim. Uh, the PMDG 737-800. We have got the 900 downloading at the moment as well. I'm going to go through the library of aircraft that uh, we can download again uh, and get them all on the sim. Darren Graham has said... <laughs> okay. What, so what song is that? What, <laughs> what song is that? What, <laughs> what song is that? I'm so confused. So let's just let me confirm that the PMDG Century 7 is back on the sim. Yes. Beautiful. Okay, so let's get rid of that and that because that's good to go. Don't need to get rid of that. We can get rid of that. Can get rid of that. Can get rid of that. Boom. Um Man flu is real. Scientists have proved man, man gets flu uh, worse than women. Uh, Sarah says, definitely definitely not worse than bloody labour. Yeah, but have you ever been kicked in the nuts? I, I feel like that's worse right now. I feel like getting kicked in the nuts is a lot worse.
Sarah says, does the pain last several hours and come and go every two minutes? It does if you get kicked repeatedly, yes. It's definitely not pleasant. You just don't understand Sarah. She doesn't, does she? Doesn't understand. You don't understand. <clears throat> You'll never get it. Says, yes, Sarah, it's called a woman nagging every 30 seconds. be able to handle labor I promise well I bet we could because like I said getting kicked in the ball bag uh, is a lot worse 100% 100% is a lot worse uh, Jack's here good evening Jack welcome along to the craziness Winding Sarah up knowing that uh, being kicked in the ball sack is uh, a lot worse than uh, childbirth. <laughs> okay, so without realizing, we have gone over the airport. We are descending down right now. And uh, we're going to be looping around shortly to join the approach. Loopy says, evening, Jack. How's your wing wang? <laughs> wing wang. Uh, Lynn says, I feel a new stream coming on uh, using one of the uh, labor simulators. <laughs> Could be interesting. What were we descending to there? 6,000 feet. Alright, let's bring the speed down to 240. round shortly and uh, going on to final approach uh, so music can go off from now 
as we prepare for our landing onto runway 10 uh, at Faro. So let's get landing lights switch. Oh shit, switched on. That was on. That's on. That's on. Just about make delivery out, but like I say, if you wait for the replay. We uh, we should be alright. Uh, Rob Brown's here. Uh, just had a mad evening, just got in, popped in to say hello. Uh, hi Rob, hope you are well. If you are, or you have enjoyed the stream tonight, even though we've gone a little bit wing-wangy, uh, this evening, uh, please do consider leaving a like on the stream. It does help us out massively. Okay, so we are descending down to. Are we still? We're still massively speeding, really. Speed brakes hugely on right now. We bring that speed right down to 180 right now. See if we can kill that speed. We are killing that speed big time. Ryanair Tree Echo Romeo, you are 18 miles west. Descend and maintain 3,000 feet. Expect RNF runway 10 approach via FR 450 transition. All right. Descend and maintain 3,000 feet. Expect RNF runway 10 approach via FR 450 transition. Still not slowing down here. In our tree, Echo Romeo. That we, we probably will do now. Okay, time to get your uh, landing uh, predictions in. Uh, I am going to get the recording going. Ideal. Uh, back into full screen. And time to get your landing recording, uh, landing recording, landing ratings in, folks. What do we think? Wing wang that like button. Do you know what? I like that. I, <laughs> I like that as a phrase. Yeah, do please do wing wang that like button. Um, Wayne going for 165. Uh, Sarah going for 479, of course. Watch Kev 267. Uh, Rob Brown 257. Have you reset the reverses? Yes. Um, I have done. They know, they now work because obviously we reversed backwards uh, on the uh, pushback earlier. Uh, I'm going to go for the approach, which I cannot turn on yet, which is annoying. However, our airport is coming up. We are still speeding quite a bit, which is slightly worrying. There's the airport, right there, right there. Uh, so let's descend to 2,000 2, feet. Okay, so we've got the aircraft steady. We've got the aircraft down to a speed that is ideal for us to use. Uh, the recording is going. So we'll be playing that back at the end of the stream. Uh, more, 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 more uh, ratings coming in. So, uh, Lynn with the one, uh, 163. Uh, Brandon, th uh, 320. Uh, Loopy, 220. Carl, 267. Jim, 295. Uh, Rob, uh, Rob Brown's a big fan of the. Um, can't set the approach mode, that's interesting. Why? Why can't we do the approach mode? We may have to hand fly it in. Okay, gear's going to come down. We're going to get that down nice and early. I'm really confused as to why we can't get approach mode on. Oh, we got it on now. So that's fine. That's on. So that should hopefully now pick up the... Uh... <coughs> 
It's Ryanair cr crew prepare <laughs> prepare for the land bang. <laughs> Right, runway's coming up. Let's uh, see what we can do here. We're going to have the landing uh, monitor as well, so you should be able to see that on touchdown. 787 does drop out of the sky, so I'm not expecting a uh, soft landing by any stretch of the imagination. Take that speed down to 160. Also got to keep an eye on the fact that we've got to wait for that nose to drop. If the nose drops, happy days. If it doesn't, oh no. So let's hope that that nose drops, otherwise we're going to have to hand fly this one in. We'll get the auto brakes on, we're going to put them on to four, so we're going to try and get this to stop quite quickly. Nose is dipping, fantastic, that's what we wanted. Did it dip? It has dipped, it's uh, slowly dipping. Bring some more flaps into the equation. Now gone for the full set as well. As we uh, get ready to land here at Faro, nose is dipped. Great news. Not a fan of this camera angle. So when we get to 500 feet, we'll take the uh, Ryanair tree, Echo Romeo, wind tree, one, one, at one, zero. take the autopilot off and the auto throttle, and we'll hand fly this one in and hopefully try and get a good landing. Here we go. Let's so uh, get on to our finals here on this fantasy flight on board the uh, Ryanair 787. Let's see what we can do here. One thousand feet past. Okay, the aircraft's going to be ours now. And the auto throttle comes off. We're in control. Quick correction. Dipping and dropping, and oh my god, where are we going? Still drops out the sky. Holy crap. I knew it would. I, I, I knew. I knew it would drop. No suitable parking spots, apparently. Uh, it's 
Fine, let's go for let's the go chosen for position is too small for your aircraft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kiss my ass. Right. Anyway, welcome a lot. Uh, welcome to Faro. Probably would have been a lot better if we did this in the 737. <clears throat> I feel like we could have had a bit more of a smoother landing, but not by much. But welcome anyway. Why are you reversing, man? What are you doing? Bloody follow me trucks, literally. What do you mean, aborted for si Kiss my fucking ass, literally. <coughs> Loopy says, what a wanger. <laughs> fucking... Why? Alright, let's uh, get some... Let's, let's get him back. Where are we going, please? What? <laughs> what? Okay, let's pick somewhere else. Let's change the facility. Let's go to gate. The chosen position is too small yes, for your aircraft. Please, any time now would be lovely. Let's uh, let's uh, cancel or sorry, let's uh, end the recording. <laughs> he's just driven into us. He's just he's just driven. Watch him! Watch him! A ball. Oh no. Oh, well done. Oh, well done, you. Man, I mean, what was the landing? 405? Eh. 405, fair enough. for flying Ryanair. Last year, over 90% of our flights arrived on time. We hope you enjoyed yours, and we look forward to welcoming you on board again soon. Ryanair. Low fares, made simple. There you go. Minus 405. It's not, it's not terrible. Still hard, though. So, so it doesn't count. <laughs> yeah, Rob Brown, that's what you've been missing, man. Is chat about whether childbirth or being kicked in the nads is uh, the worst. This is why I'm quite glad that tomorrow night I should be drinking so I won't remember any of this. <laughs> I won't remember any of the conversation that will be happening tomorrow night. But, um, yeah. We were all waiting for that, says, uh, says Brandon. Do you know what? You can have it again. for flying Ryanair. Last year, over 90% of our flights arrived on time. We hope you enjoyed yours, and we look forward to welcoming you on board again soon. Ryanair. Low fares, made simple.
There you go. You can have it one more time. <coughs> so hopefully you have enjoyed uh, tonight's flight. Um, I certainly have. It's been a lot of fun. <coughs> As we are about are about to pull into gate, uh, which will also come uh, to a cl oh, sorry puts uh, to a close. Uh, our flight and our stream for this evening. Aeroporto Faro. There you go. So, we're just going to gently Oh, it'll do. It'll do. It is close enough. Okay. We'll leave lights on and everything else because we've got to. Uh, we've got to show the replay. So. You know what's coming. Music goes on. I take myself off screen. Time for the replay. Oh, bugger, I didn't end it on the thingy. No. It's fine. It's fine, doesn't matter. Um, right, so here comes the replay. Uh, let me knock the time back. to daytime. Uh, I'm going to remove the traffic and let you uh, enjoy the landing from the outside. from about there I would say and oh, there you go there's your airplane you can now admire the uh, Ryanair landing uh, in the uh, sorry the Ryanair 787 in its entirety but thank you so much guys and girls a quick one uh, it will be Helsinki to Paris tomorrow thank you for voting uh, and uh, yeah, I'm going to leave you with the uh, the replay here. Uh, enjoy the landing, uh, and thank you so much for uh, for joining me this evening and uh, making this one of the funnest streams we've done so far, um, and the funniest stream, of course, as well. Um, take care, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Uh, time for tomorrow, I will probably uh, don't know. Keep notifications on just for the uh, for the fact that you know it could be at any point after seven o'clock. Um, but I will schedule it uh, probably tomorrow morning, so keep an eye out for that. So enjoy the rest of your Friday night, folks. Thank you so much for joining. And uh, I'm going to, as uh, Dom has just put, uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, wing wang myself off the air. So thank you so much, everybody. Take care. And uh, see you tomorrow for the next one. Uh, and uh, yeah, more shenanigans for sure. But uh, enjoy the landing. Talk to you tomorrow. And uh, yeah, enjoy the rest of your evening. Good night, everyone.
last thing has more than